Today's respite offering is moons, a set of four pieces, new, first, full, and last, by American composer Philip Schroeder, born in 1956. I previously released a recording of just one piece from the set first on July 5th, the day after a mass shooting at the Highland Park, Illinois Independence Day celebration parade. As I wrote that day, frustrated I couldn't do more, I did what I could do, which was to go to my studio, make and record some music. Playing Philip Schroeder's music helped relax me, slowed my breathing, and gave me some respite. Schroeder's written remarks tell me that my response was in alignment with his intentions. Quote, all of my music is created for the sole purpose of affecting a listener in spirit, intellect, and emotion. I find Schroeder's music hits the marks he set for himself, and as with all the music selected for this respite playlist, Schroeder's music elevates, it does not tear down. I offer it to you in the hope it brings you some respite as well. Because I believe that odds are that Philip Schroeder is not a familiar name to you, I also make this recording available on my Unknown Composers Worth Hearing playlist. Philip Schroeder's bio is quintessentially American, in his own words. Though born into a military family in 1956, Philip Schroeder has long pursued the experience of life as an expanding consciousness through creative work, meditation, and open acceptance. After 35 years teaching in higher education, Philip lives and composes on acreage outside of Walsenburg, Colorado. His music has been described as full of elegant nuance. His work addresses mystical and deeply vulnerable experience, and also as luminous, meditative, and deeply spiritual. Among the significant influences on his life and work are a variety of mystical traditions, particularly Taoism, daily meditations, nature, astronomy, geology, stillness, cats, baseball, and the love and patience of his wife, violinist Margaret Jones. Regarding luminous, meditative, and deeply spiritual, something not in Schroeder's formal bio that I found in an article published November 4, 2012 on the Arkansas online website may help understand his music better. Philip Schroeder is a long-term meditator. Quote, Schroeder meditates every day and calls the practice the most influential element of this life. Because of that, he takes what he calls a Zen approach to living, which he describes as doing one thing at a time. I cannot prove it, but I do believe that much of what I find enchanting about Schroeder's music is rooted in his daily meditation practice. If this sort of thing interests you, I point you at meditative music from other traditions. For example, Arvo Part's Christian-inspired music and a piece I recently released, Lullaby by Saba Amanikia, a follower of the Baha'i faith. I find a common thread in all these works, quiet music that elevates us beyond the day-to-day. -day. Recordings of Philip Schroeder's music are available on the Inova, Cold Blue Music, Ravello Capstone, Boston, Albany, and Vienna Modern Masters labels.
As always, I hope you find these pieces in my playing of them worthy, and they bring you, as they did me, some much-needed respite. If you're new to my channel or a long-term lurker, please hit like and subscribe. Please share if so moved. Help support this project and my respite work by clicking on the paypal.me link or using the at Andrew Krauss Piano ID on Venmo. No contracts, no pledges, no ongoing commitments, just a request to help me keep the music coming. Thank you for listening. Have a great day, wherever you are.